At this time, please recognize the Supreme Court of the State of Missouri, the Honorable Chief Justice George Draper III presiding. Well, I believe everyone is here. And were we doing the ceremony in the courtroom in my background, you would all have risen and I would say to you now, you may be seated. So you should do that wherever you are. Uh, even in this virtual world, I appreciate any decorum that you offer for the court. Uh, later on during this ceremony, I uh, will ask you to rise when we actually go through the oath. Okay. So let me say this, at this time, the Supreme Court of Missouri is convened in special session to administer the oath and to award licenses to those who have passed the bar and fulfilled the requirements for admission to the bar in our great state of Missouri. I'm George W. Draper III, presently serving as Chief Justice. I hail from St. Louis, Missouri. Also with us, and I don't know where their pictures will come up, I hope they do in a grid form or fashion, um, is Judge Mary Russell, who is from Hannibal. Good afternoon, okay. congratulations. Also with us is Judge Patricia Breckenridge, who hails from Nevada, Missouri. Good afternoon. <laughs> Even if go. you can't see me. Wonderful. Congratulations. Also with us, who is on the road, but I understand still virtual and may be able to come through, is Judge Zell Fisher from Tarkio, Missouri. I heard a Maybe hello. A wave. There we go. Technology is a wonderful thing. Also with us is Judge Paul C. Wilson, right here from here in Jefferson City. Judge Wilson, will your image come up? Yes, sir. Good afternoon. Good. Very good. Also with us, it's Judge W. Brent Powell, who's from Kansas City by way of Springfield, Missouri. Thank you, Chief Justice. Congratulations, everyone, and good afternoon. Also, with us finally is Judge Laura Denver Stith from Kansas City by way of St. Louis. Judge Stith, is your image coming through? I think so. Congratulations, everyone. And we're glad to have you in the bar with us. Wonderful. As you can see, ladies and gentlemen, we are from all over our great state. At this time, the court recognizes Teresa Levings of the Board of Law Examiners for purposes of a motion. Thank you, Mr. Chief Justice. May it please the court. I'm, I'm very, um, very happy to be here with you today and feel very privileged uh, because as we know, it's not easy to get into law school. It is not easy to graduate law school and it is not easy to pass the Missouri Bar. Uh, and I'm sure all of you would attest to that. We don't make it hard uh, just because we can. We make it hard uh, because what you will undertake as your profession <clears throat> um, carries with it huge responsibility um, as well as the opportunity for great fulfillment. Uh, but the huge responsibility makes it important um, that you learn at every step of the way uh, the seriousness of the work you will undertake and the responsibility that so many individuals will place upon you, particularly your clients. Uh, we are so happy to see your faces today because that means you have succeeded in all these um, steps. Um, and uh, I know for m most, if not all of you, today um, represents a dream that's come true. So we're happy to have you. Uh, we look forward to working with you as members of the bar. There is much um, that you can contribute uh, to your profession, to your community, and to your country. And we look forward to that. With that, Your Honor, on behalf of the Missouri Board of Law Examiners, I hereby move the admission of these candidates as the newest members of the Missouri Bar. As Ms. Spiller said, the motion is sustained. Very well. Raise your right hand 
and repeat the oath along with me, okay? I do solemnly swear or affirm. I do solemnly swear. I do solemnly swear to affirm. Right, that I will support the Constitution of the United States. Uh, I will support the Constitution of the United States. United States. I don't think I had a state. State of Missouri. And Missouri. And the in Missouri. The Constitution of the state of Missouri. I will maintain and respect due courts of justice. I will, I will maintain and respect due courts, courts of justice. Judicial officers and members of my profession. Judicial officers and members of my profession. And will at all times conduct myself with dignity. And will at all, at all times conduct myself with dignity. With dignity. Becoming an officer of the court in which I appear. Becoming of an officer, an officer of the court in which, in which I, I appear. appear. That I will never seek to mislead the judge or jury. That, that, I, that I will never seek to mislead the judge or jury. Or jury. By any artifice or false statement of fact or law. By any, By any artifice, artifice, artifice or false statement, statement of fact or law. law. That I will at all times conduct myself that I will at all times conduct myself in accordance with the rules of professional conduct in accordance, in accordance with the rules of professional, rules of professional conduct, 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 conduct and that I will practice law to the best of my knowledge and that I will, I will practice law, law to the best of my knowledge, to my knowledge and ability and, and ability, ability and with consideration for the defenseless and with and more consideration, consideration for the defense, for the defense. The defense. and the oppressed and, and the, the oppressed. oppressed so help me god so help, help, me, god. help me god help me god welcome to the profession of law you may be seated ladies and gentlemen we celebrate your accomplishment it is the court's honor to welcome each of you to the profession of law a profession that requires much for you to join and demands yet more for you to remain. Always remember the cost in time, hard work, and financial sacrifice it took to get you here today. Now you will have the enhanced ability to impact the lives of hundreds, if not thousands of people. The legal work for which you will receive remuneration, as well as the gratuitous or solicited insights you offer throughout your career will be significant. The difference for some between freedom or confinement and success or financial ruin immediately come to mind. To speak plainly, be mindful of the free legal advice your neighbors, friends, and yes, relatives now expect on any and all legal matters. Those tips you offer may result in the same enormously profound outcome as the challenging legal issue presented by the client you or your law partners desire and hope for and expect payment from as a result of an hourly bill or contingency fee. Knowledge is power. You are among the most highly educated powerful people in the world. So know this, the best lawyers are also public citizens that provide an example of leadership and service to the community. As you use your power to give advice and make decisions, whether in the practice of law or some other professional pursuit that will surely test your ethics, protect yourself, your family, your reputation, and this license, along with whatever chairs you endow or libraries you finance with your great wealth or contributions you make to the greater body of jurisprudence, your greatest legacy will be your family and reputation. So maintain familiarity with our court rules, stay versed in controlling precedent, and remember also, a very famous lawyer is credited with saying, there is no higher authority than truth, Mahatma Gandhi. With that, I tell you that we, you, stand between chaos and civilization, truth and lie, anarchy and community. This service makes our profession a noble calling. 
you now have earned a seat at this table. In conferring upon you this license, we recognize your intellect and welcome your perspective, insights, and voice. It is my understanding the licenses have been mailed or will be. Therefore, the names of the new attorneys will now be read. Ms. Levings? I know that we want to be sure uh, that our new admittees have the opportunity to meet our new president of the Missouri Bar, John Gunn. I know he has a couple of remarks and then I will start reading the names. Thank you, Chief Justice Draper and Teresa. I appreciate it. It's great to see you all. Congratulations and welcome. Thinking about your uh, bar exam experience, one word came to mind, harrowing. An adjective meaning acutely distressing, a fair way to define that experience, I suspect. When I sat for the exam in July of 2000, the electricity went out at our testing facility, the old Ramada Inn. Uh, the lights were about out for about 30 minutes. And during that time, there was enough chatter to make everybody worry that our test scores would be thrown out. That's the kind of ridiculous back in my day story you'll be able to trounce with confidence for your entire career. Under considerably less than ideal circumstances, you overperformed and we as a legal community are fortunate to have you. I could list for you all the things that Missouri Bar does for lawyers and the citizens of the state of Missouri, but, and I think I'm becoming pretty good at it. But instead, I wanna talk about you. You are primarily millennials with Generation Z standing right behind you, a digital generation. When I started in the practice, we had a fax machine and kept a log of all incoming and outgoing faxes. When my father, Michael, started in the practice, he typed his pleadings on a typewriter in triplicate using carbon paper. That combination of words alone probably seems like a foreign language to you. You've no doubt heard that you are the future. Enrollees always are. However, you are different. The world is different than it was just six months ago. While the pandemic may have caused a few issues where they didn't previously exist, what it primarily and far more importantly did is draw attention to a panoply of things that we can do better. Remote, remote court proceedings, the ubiquity of anxiety, depression, and the over consumption of alcohol, file retention and retrieval, use of technology to work from anywhere in the world, mostly from home. The list is virtually endless. Yes, the bar does have programs to address these issues, but many of us come from generations where the learning curve proves an obstacle to harnessing the full potential of the moment. As a group, you are far better positioned to be architects of our future. Recognize the, recognizing the potential of change and utilizing it to visualize what our profession and the administration of justice can be. If you all are the architects, the Missouri Bar is and will be a builder. We're thrilled beyond measure to welcome you to the profession, and I look forward to working with you to improve the legal profession, the administration of justice, and the law on behalf of all Missourians. Thank you and congratulations, and thank you, Chief Justice Draper. I think at this time, the names will be read. That is true, Mr. Chief Justice. Max Accardi, Callista Accardi, Zena Ufrasiab, Adam Agostini, Stephen Ahal, Alyssa Alexander, Molly Amick, Gary Apfel, Nicolette Armstrong, Blake Armstrong. Christopher Ash, Abigail Backrack, Alexander Bailey, Ashley Baker, Alexander Balbus, Jinbang Barbia Lee, Otto Barch, Carolina Beck. Christopher Bedell, Hannah Bedford, Brendan Bement, Michael Benet, Quinn Benson, Brad Bilyeu, Benjamin Bira, Brooke Bishop, 
Daniel Blair, Delaney Blakey, Mark Blankenship, James Blattner, Madison Bach, Benjamin Boggs, Kenneth Bohannon, Daniel Brenner, Lauren Bridge, Alexandra Brooks, Kevin Bross, Madeline Brown, Connor Brown, Clayton Buckner, Caroline Bundy, Timothy Burroughs, Ryan Butler, Charles Capps, Patrick Caracello, Grant Carper, Nathan Carroll, Ann Carter, Isaac Caverly, Brian Champion, Lillian Chen, Joyce Cho, Christopher Clark, Hannah Clark, Jacqueline Kaufman, Brad Copeland, Kevin Cowling, Michael Crawford, Jamie Curry, Denise Dantzler, Kamara Davis, Griffin Day, Evan Devers, Con <clears throat> excuse me, Connor Diaz, Michael Dole, Erica Dolan, Clayton Dowd, Michael Durbin, Michael Durham, Aubrey Dwyer, Charles Eberhardt, Elizabeth Eggleston, Samuel Elliott, Elizabeth Ellis, Shamiza Embry, Michael Epston, Christopher Escobar, John Esposito, Jake Estornell, Nicholas Fears, Christopher Fernandez, Elizabeth Fink, Jocelyn Fisk, Amber Fitzgerald, Stephanie Fitzgerald, Teresa Flores, Laurel Gaddis, Lowell Gaddis, Benjamin Gamble, Kyle Garcia, Colleen Garvey, Emma Geiger, Marissa Gerwitz, Christina Glickland, Austin Green, Colin Gregory, Caleb Gregory, Thomas Groller, Jason Hackett, Robert Hansen, Amanda Hart, Robin Harvey, Blake Hatfield, Aiden Hayward, Morgan Helper, David Hirschberger, Travis Hain, Richard Hoffman, John Holden, Emily Holtzman, Marissa Hodijak, Isaac Edie Kula, Joseph Imbergia, Jack James, Peter Jockins, Lance Johnson, Jared Jones, James Colonel, Javeria Khan, Fluffy Kilburn, Ryan Kime, Eleanor Kittlestead, Brian Kong, Anthony Kramer, Dana Kramer, Jennifer Kusmer, Joseph Kuznarek, Elizabeth, excuse me, Kathleen Lanigan, Madeline Lavelle, Holly Locke, Brett Long, Amanda Lospik, Fabian Lucedo, Nicholas Luisetti, Hannah Lustman, Cheng Li, David Maddock, Mary Meritz, Rima Mahmood, Alyssa Mariani, Ethan Matchett, McKenna McCarvey, Charles McCarty, Jack McCormick, Teresa McCruden, 
Brendan McDermott, Connor McElligot, Caroline McHugh, Daniel Meglin, Caitlin Mydell McWhorter, Jeffrey Merritt, uh, Selma Mahanovic, Eliana Navarro Gracian, Caitlin Newhouse, Charlotte Nicholas, Rachel North, Martha Wake, Lola Ajenia, Lauren Patton, Alicia Peters, Fawn Pettit, Wesley Pluvios, Amy Potberg, Joshua Powers, Shelby Pruitt, Alyssa Reinhardt, Shannon Rempe, Natalie Rizzo, Joshua, Joshua Rockers, Tanner Rolfs, Blake Ronnenbaum, Emily Ross, Tyler Ryan, Lynn Ryan, Joseph Salazar, Tate Salisbury, Robert Salter, Piper Salvatore, Allison Scoggin, Jaden Scott, David Sears, Thomas Selig, Meredith Short, Gregory Skokesey, Kyle Smith, Aaron Smith, Ryan Smith, Clifford Sovich, Devin Stepp, Emma Stewart, Evan Sullivan, Talon Sumners, Aaron Swinger, Paul Tehan, Sergio Turin, Sarah Tarnock, Brian Terrani, Samuel Thomas, Ellen Thomas, Taylor Thompson, Elizabeth Thompson, Kevin Todd, Joe Natinius, Catherine Tomey, Derek Van Beesler, Lindsay Walker, Rachel Walters, Mary Grace Warren, Mary Rachel Waterman, Tony Watkins, Casey Wan, Matthew Wayman, Catherine Weinstock, Aaron Weiss, Robert Wells, Peter White, James Wilkerson, Paul Willie, William Willis, Zachary Winter, Matthew Lithium Leach, Brittany Woodruff, Wools Woods, Sabrina Warsham, Mackenzie Yaw, Allison Young, Erica Young, and Chad Zosler. Did we miss anybody? No, that's everyone. Great. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Levings. It's well done as well. Um, thank you, Ms. Fillers and the entire staff of uh, the Board of Law Examiners. Uh, new lawyers, as I'm about to tell you, and as the wise words you heard from President Gunn, um, this is a, uh, uh, you are an interesting generation. Uh, this is an historic ceremony of sorts. You are probably the first group we've had to take the bar with the proctors being in full protective personal equipment. And that becomes important because, as I said, you are the first group to actually do that. And you endured and persevered under circumstances that were new and different for the Board of Law Examiners. So this historic ceremony is one that you might recount one day. Um, at it, every year there's a bench and bar conference that is held between the bar and the court. And at that conference, there's usually a senior member of the bar who speaks as part of that program. And that senior member often recounts past experiences they've had over the years as part of their practice. Perhaps one of you today will speak at a future meeting and recount the bar exam that you took where the proctors were in full protective personal equipment. Mm -hmm. Indeed, historic. At this time, if you have families and friends present around you at all, please join the court in recognizing our, you as newest young lawyers with a round of applause. <laughs> you new young lawyers, 
as well if you have families and friends around you. You may want to recognize those that have supported you financially, emotionally, and otherwise during the last few years with a similar round of applause. <laughs> it's a great day. Everybody leaves the courtroom happy. So have a great afternoon. Congratulations and welcome to the profession of law. Court is adjourned. Thank you everyone for participating. That concludes our ceremony. We look forward to having you as new members of the Missouri Bar.